left me this apple? Teacher's pet. So, it's time for the big test. UFC 40 is just days away. And if you picked your counter move fantasy MMA team? For those of you that like to nap during class, I'll give you a quick refresher on how to join counter move. After you enter a game, draft your team, and invite your friends to play, it's time to score points. Remember, the amount of points you score determines the amount of real cash you can win. Now for your study guide. I asked the smartest kid in the class, we call him the Bobby Fisher of MMA, to come up with some hot picks for UFC 140. So study these hard, and you may just beat that kid next to you who's throwing spitballs. By which I mean, you win a lot of money. So here we go. John Chorlish has slick submissions, and he's taking on UFC newcomer Mitch Clark. Clark is green, and has never faced anybody as good as Chorlish before. Both have a good submission game, but Trollish is better. Trollish is a good value at $4,800 and should win easily. Mark Hominick is one of the best strikers in the division and he takes on Chan Sung Jung, who also likes to strike. This one is going to end early, and between the two, Mark is a better striker. Mark is likely to get an early KO, or at least land a lot of strikes, and at $5,000, he's a great value. Antonio Rodrigo Nogueira, AKA Big Nog, takes on Frank Mir. Frank is the heavy favorite coming into the fight, but at $3,200, Big Nog makes sense as a value play. Nogueira has the tools to beat Frank, and he may not be the fighter he was, but he's still tough as ever. He's also been in training camp with his brother, Antonio Hogario, aka Little Nog, who takes on Tito Ortiz. Watch for both Nogueira brothers to bring it. There you have it, class. That's all the study guide you're gonna get from the counter move statistics department on this one. Now, go draft your team, tune into UFC 140, and make me proud.